If we can uh, talk around multi-channel retail for, for a second, I mean, we mentioned way back when that you've made it a lot easier for women uh, to walk into um, and buy sexy lingerie and sex toys, et cetera, et cetera. But assuming there may still be a slight stigma attached with walking into an Ann Summers store, in actual fact, any store um, like that, um, I'd have thought that the Ann Summers website and online channel would be generating more than 20% of your revenue at the moment, but I understand it's around 20%. So is that something you're looking to increase? Um, and what's your thoughts around? Um, yes, I mean, I, I'm a great fan of multi-channel. Um, absolutely, I think, it, you know, it's something that business, you know, have to be considering, um, you know, in today's environment. And I'm probably disappointed that our online isn't bigger than what it is. But, you know, when you're a company that grows so fast, you go through a phase of throwing people at the problem and then you're trying to cut back costs so you think well maybe you know we can have the marketing director in charge of online as well what we've done now is we have a dedicated um, e-com director you know with great experience um, so I think that's going to make a huge difference uh, to our business um, and as you probably know you know anything you want to do online seems to take forever um, but you know we are getting there and the you know, our commitment is there, and I think that's, uh, you know, hopefully we're going to see some good things in the future. Yeah, you say you're a fan of multi-channel retail, and, and we see that you, you are doing uh, all the channels. So what, what do you think is the key to getting multi-channel retailing done well, with your brand congruent across all the channels? Well, it's simple. It's, it's you know, one, our, our mantra is one and some is one way to shop. You know, and it's one of our, I was going to say pleasure principles, because that's what we call our strategy. But it's, yeah. uh, it's, it's one of the points on, key points in our strategy. You know, it's making, you know, the customer doesn't see it as, you know, different sales channels. She goes into a, an Ann Summers store and she's got something to return from party plan or she wants to order something that's only available online. You know, you've got to, you've got to be flexible, you've got to be accommodating um, because the customer sees it as one brand. Absolutely. So again, going back to your listening to the customer and giving the customer what they want is absolutely paramount.